Today marks the first day of Angel Tree Child Adoptions. WDAM 7's Delaney Dukes spoke with folks from the Salvation Army about how you can give back this holiday season. The Hattiesburg Salvation Army has kicked off this year's Angel Tree Child program. It's the public pitching in to help those that are less fortunate. There are children in need of help, and so we call it adopting the angel. There will be Christmas trees in various locations across the hub city where the angels can be adopted. There's no adoption papers. There's <laughs> just a piece of paper that lets them know the first name of the child, plus their wants and wishes and sizes and things like that. Captain Evelyn Thornhill from the Salvation Army says this program is something that resonates deeply with her. I'm the oldest of six children and we were very poor. I lived in Meridian, Mississippi. We found out about the Salvation Army and they recognized that my mom needed help. Thornhill said at the time the Angel Tree program had not been officially established, but folks at the Salvation Army still found a way to give back to her and her family. I can remember the first First Christmas, I think I was nine years old, they brought me a little pair of plastic high heels and that was my Christmas present that year. <laughs> and that's the reason I give back. She hopes anyone that has experienced something like this will help out another family in need this holiday season. I'm sure that all of us at one time or another have seen or experienced ourselves a need. And if that need has been met, then there's something within us that just makes us want to say thank you in a way outside of ourselves, you know. It's like paying it forward. She says if you cannot adopt an angel but still want to help out, you can make a monetary donation. In Hattiesburg, Delaney Dukes, WDAM7, on your side.